Well, there are several IT cell volunteers and registered warriors with respect to the whole BJP's office that we have to talk about. A day before election, what a war room looks like is what we are going to take you at the New Indian. So a day before, uh, you know, the second phase of the elections that uh, Gujarat state is going for, we see there's a lot of hustle bustle in war room. What is it like? Yeah, it has always been like this the, from the day elections were announced. And even before that, we have been working very hard at the media team. Uh, we are monitoring the news. We are preparing all the inputs to be given to various media. Now that we have uh, electronic media and the print media, the different people are working on different media. And the kind of uh, information that is now originating, uh, we, all the leaders' campaigns and all which we have covered, now the f f finishing studies are being put to the whole campaign. And by tomorrow evening, uh, most of us will be relieved. For the last one month, uh, it has been like that, and I don't think any one of us has gone home before two o'clock in the night. And uh, it has been a, a tough campaign because of, uh, because of there's a, a, a much more to be given to the media in 2022 than in 2017 because of number of channels has increased, number of publications has increased, and there are also digital channels also which are very active. So all that has to be seen, and because of the whole campaign. Has, is being monitored from here and uh, all the details about each of these uh, meetings that we held, public meetings or road shows, and that all that is being covered by the media and uh, the, it all originates from here. Well, we see certain screens of news channels uh, and I see several uh, people right now on their computers. If you can just throw a bit of light, what is everyone doing right now? We uh, monitor the uh, news channels also and uh, then we, uh, we prepare a daily report of uh, what channel is doing what and uh, how we have been, uh, the news we have been covered and all. And uh, a lot of people, are, all these people on this side are working on uh, the preparing the details for uh, the leaders who are going to vote tomorrow. And that will be sent to the media in, uh, before evening and so that, that they can cover the uh, Honorable Prime Minister, the Honorable Union Home Minister and other leaders, the Chief Minister, everyone is going to vote tomorrow. So all that is being prepared, their programs is being uh, coordinated and uh, uh, this side the people are uh, monitoring the uh, room and uh, preparing other press releases. Sir, uh, if we have to talk about WhatsApp, how is it that uh, BJP's experts are working on the WhatsApp? We have got a huge team of media, uh, social media warriors and they are working day and night on this and uh, because of the use of technology we have been able to reach out to all the voters, the media and for example we have uh, WhatsApp broadcast, broadcast groups which reach out to all the journalists who are covering the Gujarat elections and that is why we have been able to disseminate information very quickly and very, uh, uh, I would say, very effectively. There are about 250 people who are working day and night and uh, who, will, uh, who have been monitoring the social media feed of, um, uh, across the, the spectrum, whether it is Instagram, whether it is Facebook, it is WhatsApp. And uh, we have been responding, we have been uh, setting our, uh, sending our information, with the photographs or videos of our leaders' meetings and all. I mean, all the kind of positive information that we want to send out is being managed very well with, by the uh, social media team. There have been very low voter count that has come out. How is it that uh, the volunteers at your place are looking at it, that everyone steps out and votes tomorrow? We have continuously been telling the voters, not only in this election, but even when we were in the opposition 25 years back, we always urged the voters to come out and vote. And uh, over the years, the, the percentage of voting in urban areas has been less than in rural areas, I agree. But to, for, to give you an example, in the last uh, 2021 February, we had the municipal corporation elections in all the major cities of Gujarat. Mm -hmm. And at that time, there was more than 60% voting even in the cities, which was a rare occurrence. But then even during COVID, that election was held and people had come out to vote. We are very optimistic that tomorrow also people will come out and vote in big numbers. And how confident you are for the elections to uh, go ahead and win a vote and it's BJP? I think we have first, after the first phase, we have almost won the election and uh, definitely uh, we'll get more than three-fourths of this number of seats.